Hello and welcome back to my channel or if you're new then hello, welcome. For today's video I am bringing you a haul from Shein. I haven't shopped at Shein in probably about a year. I've literally spent loads of money at Shein, bought loads of stuff to revamp my wardrobe and I thought I would show you guys. If you like this video please give it a huge thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe down below if you're not ready and let's just get straight into the video. I've got like a massive bag and like loads of massive bags. I don't think I actually picked up too many pieces one piece that i picked up is actually like five in one if you include them i probably bought about like 20 items let's just get started so i'll just get started with what i've got out of my bag already so the first item is this massive bag and this was probably the main reason why i placed this order and the one that i'm most excited for the first one is a brown chocolate gillet 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 i don't know one of those sleeveless puffer coats which i love i am going to do a try on clip for you guys so you can see how i would style it. I'm also going to be uploading all these pieces onto my Instagram as well so make sure you go check out my Instagram. It will be on screen for you now and it'll be down in the description below. I'm sorry but this is just the cutest colour and I've been getting a lot of inspo from people on Instagram and seeing like all their styles and I'm like okay I don't think I'm gonna suit that style but I'm gonna try it out anyway and I've fallen in love like my style has changed like drastically but like going like staying at home clothes like clothes that I'm wearing like now <laughs> haven't changed but for when I go out to like events and stuff well I say events like stuff that I planned then my style has changed like drastically I picked this up in a size medium because I wanted something a bit oversized because like you'll probably see in the try and clip that I would have put like a hoodie so I need it oversized to be able to do that so yeah I picked it up in a medium and it was 19 99 which is a bargain. I've seen stuff on like Boohoo and pretty little thing that I've liked but thought why not get one off Shein that's half the price. So that's what I did. So that's the first item that I picked up. Then the next item again like I said is the one where it's got like five in one. I was looking for some more bodysuits because it's getting to that time where like I just want to throw something on and have like a bodysuit underneath but it to look nice. So I picked up five, is it four? Oh no four actually. Four different bodysuits. So I already have a white one, so I went with a darker light colour scheme. First of all, there's this colour, so like it's obviously like a brownie chocolate colour. I got it in a medium, and they all are ribbed as well, which is what I like because it gives it a little bit of texture. It's got the racer style top, which is this kind of style that I was going for, because the other bodysuit that I've got that is similar to this is one from Zara, so I thought I wanted to keep them all like sort of similar. And like I said, it is a bodysuit, so it does have the little clips at the bottom, which are an absolute nightmare. Nightmare. So that's the first colour. So I picked that up in a medium. Then it came with a black colour, which black goes with everything. So fabulous. Then, then I went for this kind of colour. I'm not this tan colour, I'd say. Obviously, like I didn't get to pick what colours were in the thing. And then it just comes with a blue one. So I was like, okay, I don't mind a blue one. This is like it's a bit out there and it's very vibrant. So sometimes you might want to wear something colourful. So yeah, so I got all four of them and all four, because it came as one, was 26 pounds 99 which i thought was a bargain actually and it's really really good quality as well <laughs> like it's not too thin but it's not too thick at the same time i think the ribbed effect makes it that little bit thicker so that's all of them then i don't know if you watched my boohoo haul like probably about a year and a half ago or something but i know probably this time last year actually i picked up a shirt like an oversized shirt and it was checkered and it was pink but i just didn't like the vibe of it whatsoever like it was just too like it was oversized but like the arms were like huge and like i don't know i just weren't vibing it and the color wasn't really feeling me i like them style jackets so i thought you know what it's autumn why don't i get an another one but from shein and an autumnal color so i have already worn this out because i couldn't help myself so this is it like i'm sorry but this is probably my second favorite purchase out of it all and like i said you know it is really oversized and it is a shirt and it's quite I wouldn't say it's quite thick but it's like it's thick enough to wear a t-shirt underneath or a bodysuit underneath and then that coat and then that's it you know but I just love the colour of this because it's not too out there yeah that's basically all I have to say about it so I picked this up in a medium as well I've literally picked most things up in a medium because with Shein I get a little bit worried about the sizing so I have to like go through the comments and read to the, for them to be like size up size down so this was a 13.99 what a bargain 
in. Like I said, I've already worn it out um, and I'll probably be wearing it out several other times. You'll probably see it all over my Instagram in the next couple of weeks, months. This next one was, I'm 50-50 on this. I'm going to keep it just because I don't have anything like this in my wardrobe, but like I'm not 100% on it, if that makes sense. I bought a hoodie, just a cream hoodie. I thought this would go really, really nice with like black jeans and then my coat, my gillet on top because I don't have like the only other hoodie I have is one of my boyfriend's hoodies that is no longer fits him which is like a gamer hoodie sort of thing so it's not really a vibe for going out in but as it's getting a bit colder now and like if it starts raining just put your hood up like I don't I don't really have many coats that have hoods as well so fabulous this has got the drawstring and then it's got the pocket at the front the only thing about this is it's I just don't like the feel of it I don't really know how else to explain it but it's it feels thick but like if you look on the inside I'm not sure if you can sort of see there's not very much fluff there i'm just not sure on the the feel of the material and that's the only thing that's putting me off but yeah again i got this oversized because oversized everything in autumn is just the best again got this in a medium when do i not get anything in a medium and this was a bargain this was eight pounds 50p like eight pound 50 for a hoodie you can't go wrong like i can't complain about the feel of it when it cost me eight pound 50 and i probably will get a lot of wear out of this as well this was something that i bought but i 100 percent know i'm going to send it back i've bought something similar since this anyway that i much prefer hence the reason why i'm going to send it back but yeah so i thought i'm gonna be one of those people one of those girls that's wearing these knitted jumpers because i love the vibe this one i'm not 100 thrilled about i don't know if it's because i don't have the right shirt to go underneath it or the one that i've bought since is like top tier it's my favorite and i think that's why maybe if i hadn't bought that first and then wait until this arrived then maybe i'd have different opinions on this don't get me wrong there's nothing wrong with it you know it's quite a thin knitted jumper i like the color of it obviously i got it oversized because i did want something to be tight figure hugging but yeah there's nothing else really to say on that you'll see it better on the try and clip to be quite honest with you again i got this in a medium and you had to buy the shirt separately to this which i will show you in a minute and that isn't bad for 11 pound 99 you can't go wrong can you for 12 pound then i've just got two items left which is the shirt for that and then another jumper too i bought a shirt to go with my knitted jumper it's just a plain white shirt like there's nothing really to say about it it is it's pretty see-through but when you put a jumper on top of it it's not obviously it doesn't matter if it's see-through i think i bought this oversized which the arms are oversized as you can see the only problem is it's too short for me and that's probably why i don't like the knitted jumper and this shirt together because i wanted the shirt to be like longer than the knitted jumper but it's like it's, i won't even say cropped because it's not cropped but i would prefer it much longer but it doesn't and that's it really it's a actually really nice material and it's not satin it's just a not well i think i did buy it as a satin but it's, i've got other satin shirts and it don't feel like a satin shirt so so i've got that in a size medium so i would advise if you do get this because i will leave the links in the below do size up twice because i size up for my normal size my normal size is a small so i'll size up because i want it to be oversized but it's just not big enough for me i have to size up again and that was 11 pound 50 i actually ordered them all together as like one package but for some reason this literally came within two days and it came from the uk it came in like two days and then i had to wait an extra week for everything else to arrive the last item that i picked up is it's cute it's cute it's a vibe i love it on fridays at work i like like the company that i work for is very casual like i could go in casual clothes every single day but i kind of like the fact of going to an office and wearing like shirts and dressing a little bit smart but like smart casual so on fridays i like to do i just have that casual day just shove a jumper on, especially in winter and autumn shove a jumper on jeans traders go to work fine i've been wearing the same jumpers for the past like month and i thought you know what i need to kind of switch it up a little bit but I bought myself a new jumper and I love it but the colour looks completely different to what it did on screen so I'll picture, put a picture up here of what it looked like on screen compared to this I don't know if you can see that it's, it's kind of a bit more tanny yellowy orangey in person and I thought it was gonna be like a nice little cream colour but I don't mind the thing about this is you know when I was talking 
earlier on in the video about the other jumper that I picked up, how I didn't like the material. Well, this is exactly the same. It's the material, but I can deal with it because I don't actually like you, I, inside. I can deal with it outside of the material that I don't like. You don't have to touch it often, so it's fine. Anyways, I bought this because I loved the cute little butterfly on the front, but you just wait till the back. I'm sorry, but the back is my favorite. Like, I just love that. So it's got a massive butterfly on it, and I'm not sure what the writing actually said. Finished rules are made to be broken and then it says this story is not finished which is kind of a vibe but yeah i bought it for this like i just love the little butterfly there was loads of different style like the same jumpers but the writing on the back was different the butterfly was placed different but they were all like pretty similar which i liked again i picked this up in a medium i haven't tried this on yet but i think i love it it's just for work do you know what i mean and this was nine pound 99 which I th i'd say is a bargain for a jumper it's gonna do the job it's gonna keep me warm and and I love it. Look at that. Isn't that just cute? I'm vibing with it. And that is my haul done. I really hope you enjoyed this haul. Let me know what other shops you want me to buy from and to do hauls from. And I will happily supply because hauls are my favourite things to film ever. But I really hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a huge thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe down below. And I'll see you in my next video. Bye.